ChatGPT now has a brand new plugin for Canva so you could create entire social media posts, photos, and videos with a simple text prompt. Now, Canva has been around for a long time. It's the leading design platform on the web, but this new plugin integration brings it right inside of ChatGPT. Let me show you how to activate it here. Inside of ChatGPT, you need ChatGPT Plus. So this is the version of ChatGPT that gives you access to plugins. So if you don't have this yet, you need to upgrade from the free version to be able to use this. But Canva and this plugin for Canva are free to use. So first go over here to settings and go to settings and beta. Go to beta over here and make sure plugins are activated here and they will appear right underneath. Next, you just have to go over here and make sure you got a check mark next to plugin by clicking next to it. Then we're gonna click this drop down and go all the way to the bottom to the plugin store. And you just wanna search the plugin store for the plugin Canva. Here, just press install here. It's gonna install it. Let me exit here. And on your drop down menu here, make sure you have Canva checked on. So my Canva is checked on. Now I'm ready to go with a text prompt. Now with the Canva plugin activated, I could say something like create a social media post for Instagram for my Black Friday sale. And usually when you ask it something that's going to require the Canva plugin, it's just going to know to activate the Canva plugin. So that's what it did. If it doesn't do this for some reason, just say use the Canva plugin to create a post for Instagram for my Black Friday sale. And it's gonna create these type of posts. And it's gonna give you multiple different options here. So these are just photo posts. I could ask for video posts. I'll show you a couple of different examples here. But you could see here, I got a Cyber Monday one, Black Friday one, and each one comes with a little preview. This is basically your post. And it comes with a link. Now here is the most powerful part of this thing. This is not just gonna be something you grab from here and save to your computer and post. You can do that, but obviously you probably wanna customize it. So this link right on top, if you click it, it opens up Canva. I'm not even signed in, so you could see I could just use this on a free account, but typically you wanna create an account here, a free account. They do have paid upgrades that give you more options, but a lot of people use Canva for free. It has a lot of use cases that you could do without paying for the premium. And as you can see over here, all these things are clickable and they're all editable. So I'll just give you an example of one of my favorite options under style over here. I could change the color palette of this post just by clicking these different color palettes. You don't have to use really any design skills here. These color palettes already show you colors that go well together. So you could just choose one of these options and then customize it further from here. Then you also have elements, so you could drag any one of these elements onto your post here. You have text if you want any additional text. You could double click to edit any existing text and you could upload your own logo or any type of design elements that you want just from the upload tab here and upload videos too if you wanna turn this into a video post. And when you're done, just press share over here. Again, I recommend you sign in so it saves this. You could always come back to it and just press download and download it as a PNG. And there it is, I could just go ahead and open it and here's the post. I could just post it to Instagram directly from my computer. You could also do things like creating logos or even entire website templates. I just wrote create a logo for my photography business. Canva got activated over here. And as you could see, here's a logo for my photography business. Here's another one and it's making one more over here. And as usual, if you click on one of these, it's gonna open up Canva in the editing menu of Canva where you could select any one of these. You could go ahead and type in your own name here and you're ready to download this as well. Now Canva has a lot of different options. If you've never used it before, it's extremely powerful. So I'll put a link to a complete Canva tutorial that I have where it shows you exactly how to use Canva outside of ChatGPT because once you get into it, you could customize everything that you see over here. This time I'm gonna say use the Canva plugin to create an Instagram real video. This time I'm gonna ask for a video template to promote my upcoming launch. This could be for a book launch or product launch, anything you could imagine. This could be a good prompt for that. And as usual, it's gonna to go to work, give me some options. This one is really nice. And as usual, if I just click over here, it's gonna open this up. This is in video format, so if I just press play on top, you could see the style of the video. And all the text, if I click away, all this text here, I could customize exactly the way I want. And typically, I like to go to the upload tab, upload my own logo, maybe a little video I have. I could even have myself talking here, put in the launch date. 
and I'm ready to go to post this on all kinds of different video based social medias as well. And as I mentioned in the description, you'll find a complete Canva walkthrough to show you exactly how to use Canva from scratch. And we also have an entire dedicated platform to learning AI. So everything in the world of AI, we are rolling out new courses for, we have over 10 different courses right now, and you could watch them all for one subscription. They're all in one subscription. You don't have to buy individual courses. That's called Skill Leap. I'll put a link in the description to that as well. I hope this saves you a lot of time with starting any design that you need, and I'll see you on the next video.